Conley Cadets on to the second round for the first time since 2014, taking on defending state champion Texarkana Pleasant Grove in Roy City this afternoon. Second quarter, Pleasant Grove up 3-0. That is James Wiggins in from one yard out, 10-0 at the half. Mid-third quarter, Cadets handed off to JV on Sunday. He goes left, goes back, oh, to the other side of the field, takes off down the sidelines, waits for his blockers. 47 yards later, he is in for the touchdown. Then later in the drive, Sunday from one yard out, extra point goes off the uprights to Conley trails 10-6. Same score in the fourth quarter. Hawks have it fourth and goal at the four inch line. Bruce Garrett taking the pitch around the left side. He's in for the touchdown, 17-6 at that point. And Pleasant Grove goes on to win 24-6. Connolly, they finish the season with a record of eight and four. Curtis Quillen, he was at both games from start to finish. Curtis, let's start with Lorena. Now, if there's ever a time to get hot in the postseason, it's right now, especially heading to round three. Yeah, and you got to say, Lorena is playing its best football in the last couple of weeks. A dominant showing in the second half tonight against Liberty Ilo, and that's in spite of Liberty Ilo making an enormous comeback. Connolly, one thing to keep in mind about their game earlier this afternoon here in Roy City, they look tremendous up until the fourth quarter when they win. Pleasant Grove started to pull away. In fact, if you can take a look at the Connolly game, this game started off as a seesaw game immediately. The cadets received the opening punt or the opening kick. They're forced to punt. The punt is blocked, but then they hold Pleasant Grove to just a field goal. The Hawks then add a touchdown, go into the half. It's 10 nothing. The beginning of the third quarter, Pleasant Grove gets the ball, has to punt. So it becomes the JV on Sunday show from there. A 47-yard run down the sideline sets up a beautiful touchdown run, and it looks like the cadets are in business. They wind up. Uh, Pleasant Grove's offense starts rolling from there. They get the 24-6 win. Uh, Lorena, this game a shootout early on. It was like, first, who, at first we're thinking first one to 60 wins, but then A.J. Bell with four touchdowns is the star of this game for Lorena, the former Gridiron Player of the Week for his four touchdown performance against Teague. The defense comes up huge in the second half, though. An interception in the fourth quarter seals the deal for Lorena. And now they're headed on to the third round. They will play Pittsburgh next week. We're still waiting to hear where that one is, but the facilities people here at Roy City tells me there is a chance that that game is right back here in Roy City sometime next week. As soon as we find out, we will let you know. Nick, we'll talk to you here in a little bit. For now, live in Roy City, Curtis Quillen, Channel 6 Sports. All right, Curtis, we'll talk to you just a bit. Big win by Lorena. We'll